The challenging part was making them understand what it means to ride 200 miles. It's so hot, I'm so tired, I'm gonna give up. I told myself, it's okay, I'm gonna keep pushing. We, were, we went to the park, me and my brother, and we started playing basketball. And he was like, just take a shot, just take a shot. I actually made a free throw shot and he was like, you're really good when you're angry. And I was like, I just, I'm tired of school and stuff like that. She's a fighter. Um, and if someone went against what she said, she would fight back. The turning point for me was around middle school. I had had a bad experience with some bullying and I decided that no matter what, I was gonna stick with it. I was gonna earn my gold award and through my gold award, it helped me join the military. Tour de Sihasin uh, means Tour de Hope. It started in 2012. I started a community bike ride. This year, I wanted to involve our Girl Scouts. It was a 200 mile bike ride and it was over the course of eight days. Adelante Jovencitas, it means young women moving forward. Our scouts come from untraditional backgrounds. When I started Girl Scouts, it changed my whole entire life. I've known Delfina for over two years. She's a leader, but it wasn't always the case. She didn't let her guard down for anybody until she knew she could trust you. The Gold Award is the highest award that a Girl Scout can earn. I always wanted to earn it because it was just such an accomplishment for a Girl Scout to have. For my Gold Award, I found an apartment complex that had just opened up. It helps with um, taking the homeless veterans off the streets. And they had a teen room there that was completely empty for the kids of the veterans that lived in the building. And so I decided to put together a room for them, as well as a game room for the veterans upstairs. Sin Hassan in Navajo means hope. We had named um, our bike ride that because of our interest in providing education on suicide prevention. At the time, it seemed every month we had a suicide in the community. I explained the cause of the ride to the girls and they understood that um, because some of them came up and they said, I'm riding for, for this. And that's what I rode for because one of my classmates committed suicide this past year. I think riding on behalf of her friend it was going to make her stronger, make her more courageous of taking care of others and looking out for her own friends. Me getting bullied in school and stuff because of my weight and everything like that, like, it brought me down. I had low self-esteem. Girl Scouts started helping me to, like, not care what other people talk about. Nobody's going to stop me from doing what I want. Girl Scouts shows a girl and a woman that there's nothing that a girl can't do. They know when their troop leader is supportive of them. They know when you're taking the time to help them grow as a person. One of our safety mottos that we did every day was called the ABCs of biking. The ABCs was air, brakes, and chain. Claudia is amazing. She talked a lot about how it would relate to life. Air means take care of yourself, your breathing. Breaking means, you know, you can go fast through life, but there's times that you have to break. And then how C, the chain on our bikes, is the heart of our bikes. So we got to also think about ourselves, stick to what's passionate for us. That's part of how you can get through life is shifting through those moments. My dream college is NAU. When I went to school, we had, the, we had a summer basketball program. So my coach asked me, you're a senior, correct? And I was like, yes. There was a scholarship open for NAU. And so he told me that if my grades were good and I was doing good in school, that he would give me the scholarship. I was like, oh, that's the next plan. Girl Scouts, they would be tutors to us and help us with our homework if it was social studies, English, math. And so I worked extra hard. So that's how I got my scholarship for NAU. She was a catalyst for a lot of the girls to jump into something different or to go for what um, your dreams are. For me, some of the benefits of the Gold Award, instead of going in as an E1, I went as an E3, so it's about a double pay raise. Some of the other benefits include college scholarships. It shows employers that you have leadership qualities and that you'll always try your best. I learned a lot about myself doing this ride. I would say like Girl Scouts isn't just about like 
selling cookies, going door to door. It's a, it's a lot more than that. It's opportunities. We don't see a lot of this on, on the reservation, so I feel Girl Scouts has a huge impact right now. And when they leave our um, communities, I want them to feel that connection, that they can come back and it'll still be there for them and maybe their grandkids or their kids as well. And Girl Scouts brought that for us. Adelanto Jovencitas um, definitely needs to continue for as long as possible for some of the girls that we're serving through the troop. Girl Scouts is the way that they can move forward. I actually want to thank everybody, even the person who even created Girl Scouts. Like, it, it just changed my life a lot. The impact that each individual has when they donate to Girl Scouts is felt immediately by the girl, and the girls know it. It's definitely changed the way that I am as a person and it's helped me to always want to do the best that I can for the people around me and for my community and now my country.